dear dear ones again i came to give some news from ukraine in my hand this is small michael he is 14 days he born the next day started in his own country this war he doesn't know what is happening in his own country her mother took him from hospital the next day and sat 5 days underground the 5 days he traveled to reach north place it is only 800 km but on the way there, there was bombing so they couldn't travel long time so she told me he she took this child in this position 10 days can you imagine how much this lady suffered how much how, how was her her mental condition now our michael he is safe many many stories i can tell you three or five ch- children their parents rod in their hand address and a mobile number and send send them to another place because the parents they couldn't travel they want to escape their children so the children came to railway station in another places and to show this their hand there was written address and phone number like that their parents knew where their children are it is very hard to achieve in ukraine now bombing is continuing more than sort of children like michael died innocent children last time i had said um, we don't know this uh, old people who paralyzed still now we have no any information from them maybe they died in ukraine people are running from place to place they are hiding himself last day we took nine people nine ladies from railway station on the way they disturbed us asking where you took us because all people they have fear they are trying to any shelter please pray for the grain please pray to stop this war please open your eyes open our hearts to pray for this little michael he is only one he is asking prayer from you all he is a representative of all innocent children here thank you very much for your prayer in our house now about 75 people are living in one room nine or 10 and we gave our comment for the people and the sisters room also we gave for them i am so happy that i am in that